There are a few different words people are using to describe the recent stretch of weather. I'm just disappointed. Miserable, uh, sweaty. <laughs> it's just hot, man. It's ridiculous. I'm about to move up north for good. Still, plenty of people were out and about on a September Sunday in Phoenix. That saw a high temperature hit 113 degrees. There were also plenty of water bottles and people searching for shady spots. We yeah. usually just buy waters, like just stay hydrated. Living in the desert, there's an expectation of hot temperatures. But it's never been this hot this late in the year before. It seems pretty crazy to have it this late in October, or you know, going into October, I should say, and uh, it's still well, well over 110. So normally this time of year, you know, I'd say it's, it's still warm all the way up until Halloween, but it's normally under 100 or at least 100. The Maricopa Association of Governments is extending its heat relief map through the end of October, showing which water, cooling, and donation sites are open at any given time. And in the city of Phoenix, the 24-hour respite center at Burton Bar Library is now staying open through October 7th. Both were originally set to end for the year after September. It's got to treat it like it's still summer. I mean, you got to stay hydrate, hydrated, stay indoors. And here in the city of Phoenix, they will also be keeping all of their cooling centers and hydration stations open through October 7th as well. Those will be open during normal business hours. Now, we have a lot more information on all of these heat relief networks and efforts going on across the valley right now on our website, azfamily.com. But for now, reporting live in Phoenix, Zach Perlutsky for Arizona's Family.